bake sale to raise money for new cheerleader uniforms? Well, I'm not opposed to a little something sweet in the middle of the afternoon. Well, your neighbor bought two bags of chocolate chip. Only five dollars. Good luck. Hope to see you out of that old uniform soon. Goddess is alive, demons are afoot. The 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 goddess is alive, demons are afoot. In 1564, Nostradamus predicted the destruction of Earth in three terrifying waves. The first wave is here. My name is Kate Foster. These are my journals. They killed my wife, framed me for murder. Now I run, but I don't hide. With the prophecies of Nostradamus as my guide, I seek them, I hunt them. I will stop the first wave. Quatrain 42, Century 6. The dark craft shall slay the dragons conjured by the humble raven. This Nostradamus quatrain has brought me to Salem, Oregon where high school senior Diana Black has been charged with multiple first-degree murders, all prominent Salem citizens. Diana claims she's a witch. I'm here to see if her dark powers are of the alien variety. Her attorney needed an investigator, so Eddie created a false set of credentials. And guess who got the job? Time to see what's brewing in old Salem. The defense will tell you that Diana Black comes from a broken home. Abandoned by parents who did not love her, you may feel tempted to empathize with Diana. Don't. Sympathize instead with the three unsuspecting victims lured into buying a poison that ripped through their intestines like a chainsaw. Diana Black may look like an innocent high school senior, but I will prove that she is, in fact, a deluded, and dangerous woman consumed with the black art of witchcraft. I object, Your Honor. Witchcraft is a benevolent religion recognized in 1988 by the World Council of Churches. Explain to me what's benevolent about a religion that encourages murder. The defendant's religious beliefs are irrelevant here. Order. Counselors will approach the bench. I have barred everyone but legal counsel from this courtroom because of Diana's delicate age. I'm not about to allow either of you to turn this into a modern day witch hunt. Your Honor, I must be permitted to present the defendant's belief in herself as a witch because it motivated her actions. The prosecution is merely exploiting prejudicial stereotypes dating back to the 1600s when witches were hanged for allegedly trafficking with the devil. Witchcraft is satanic. Worship. Witchcraft takes its teachings from nature, not from Satan. The prosecution makes a strong case for motive. I'm going to have to allow. <clears throat> Your Honor, may I have a moment to confer with my investigator? In Dodge versus the Salvation Army, a federal judge upheld the witch's constitutional right to worship. Your Honor, if Mr. Phipps insists on basing his prosecution on the practice of witchcraft, then he will be treading on First Amendment issues that might result in a mistrial. Ms. 
Corey has made a salient point. I suggest the prosecution focus its attention on the defendant's actions as they pertain to the deaths without couching them in religious rhetoric, outdated or otherwise. Court will be in recess for one hour. My name is Kate. I know who you are. My private eye. I'm here to help you. I don't need your help. I think you do. This whole town is on a witch hunt. And in case you haven't noticed, they think they found one. If you're here to cheer me up, you're not doing a very good job. I'm here looking for some answers. The rest of this town is looking for blood. Did you kill those people? They weren't people. You mean you could care less about them? No, they weren't people. The ingredients are harmless on people. Then who were they? Demons. Diana, the ingredients you used in your recipe, where did you get them? A book. What book? It's a powerful book. Better off if no one knows about it. Look, three people are dead. And if you're convicted, you could be the fourth over some game. It's not a game. You don't understand. You're judging me just like everyone else. What I did was good. No one understands. Sorry, man. Pass me napkin. Thank you. You know that chili dog is practically a complete meal? It is. The complex protein provided by the bean is on my Focus, meat. Eddie. I have no time for nutritional analysis right now. How was the uh, tip that I gave you about Dodge versus Salvation Army? Oh, what a charm. Sometimes I don't know what I'd do without you, Eddie. Um, I've been doing a little bit more... Uh, Digging since you were in there and uh we're what? what is it, Eddie? I hate being out in public. Makes my ulcers burn. Are you sure it's not the chili dog? I'm nervous, man. I don't like you going in this courtroom. It's dangerous. Somebody might spot you. Don't worry, Eddie. I'll watch out for myself. All three murder victims were civic leaders in town. That was the only connection. What more do you want? It's right there in the quatrain. The dark craft shall slay the dragons conjured by the humble raven. Hello? Diana's the raven, an alien targeting strategic town leaders, the dragons. And when the police nabbed her, they labeled her as a witch? Bingo. I don't know if I buy into that now. I read the deposition, and most of her magic truths can all be passed off as coincidence. Foster, it's not like she's just some kid playing with some toy bake oven. I downloaded the coroner's report. All the cookie ingredients read like Kevorkian's cookbook. Except the chocolate chips. Hemlock, nightshade berries, amphibian secretion, probably from a toad, periwinkle, powdered earthworm, not more shrub. None of these ingredients were in toxic doses. Hundreds ate them, but only three died. Maybe some common allergic reaction. Check it out. Many other similarities you can come up with on the victims. I want it. Oops. Oops. I know who you are. <laughs> You're a no-name detective trying to make a name for himself in a witchcraft case. My case. Mess with me and you wish you never set foot in a sailor. According to your statement to the police, you and your friends all belong to a coven of witches. Is that correct? Yes. So you're in high school, 
French and world history aren't quite doing it for you. So one day you just say to yourself, I think I'll become a witch. Objection, Your Honor. Sustained. I'll rephrase. How did you and Dinah decide to form your covenant? Diana thought well, it just seemed like an exciting thing to do at the time. So, Diana was a good friend. Well, not always. So, I asked her if she had a darker shade, right, and as soon as she went over the counter to check, reached over, stole the whole box. Yes. <laughs> okay, so, Mary, truth or dare? Dare. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we dare you to flash the team next time they run downfield. You guys suck. <laughs> oh, come on, Mary. It's not like half those guys haven't seen them already. Oh, oh my god. You go, girl! <laughs> Teeth are turning yellow. Shut up. Maybe the loser has matches. Hey, don't call her over here. There's a reason she's alone. She's a freak. I don't want to be friends with her. I just want a light. Hey, Scarecrow, got some matches? Cool lighter. You want a butt? No, thanks. Bad for the lungs. Bad for the lungs. Stick around. This should be good for some laughs. Okay, yeah, Abby, it's your turn. I don't trust you guys. <laughs> Stupid jerk. Oh, oh, man, nice melons, Mary. Hey, mind if I uh, inspect them for freshness? Ross, please. Oh, don't sweat it, baby. You know you're my only one, huh? I mean, these other girls mean nothing to me, right? Truth. Tell us your deepest, darkest secret about Ross. Mm-hmm. No, I choose to. No, 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 no. I already took truth. There's no take backs. You must answer. Ross? Mm -hmm. I want to break up with him, but I'm scared. Don't be scared. You just got to dump that chum. I tried to once before, and he totally lost it. Why don't you break up with him at school? That way he can't hurt you. She's right. Do it today. Okay, Diana, your turn. Truth or dare? Truth. Tell us something about yourself that no one else knows. Well, come on, speak up. I'm a witch. Objection! This is irrelevant, Your Honor. I'm establishing a pattern of behavior that leads directly to the murders. Stay on track, Mr. Phipps. I'll allow. Elizabeth, when did you begin to believe that Diana had special powers? When she pulled out the knife? The prosecution would like to introduce this as item 12. Can you tell me the significance of this knife? <laughs> Are you a good witch or a bad witch? Hey, Sabrina, blink me up something to eat. I'm starving. <laughs> a knife. It's an athame. Witches use them to direct psychic energy out from their bodies.
pour your coffee into the hole. This is so lame. That latte cost me three bucks. Artemis, virgin of the hunt. Separate the skies from the waters and dance upon them. Separate the skies from the waters and dance upon them. You're a freak. And you sure a fake. Separate the skies from the waters and dance upon them. Separate the skies from the waters and dance upon them. Separate the skies from the waters and dance upon them. Separate the skies from the waters and dance upon them. step down. This court is adjourned and will reconvene at two o'clock this afternoon. I'm sorry, Diana. Cade, when we put Diana on the stand, we have to make it clear that the sprinklers were just a coincidence. But they weren't. Are you saying you made that happen? I did make that happen. Diana, that jury needs to be convinced that you're no different than they are. And if they hear from you that you're a witch, then there's a pretty good chance they're going to condemn you for being one. Then they don't understand. There's nothing evil about it. Real witchcraft is about rooting out evil. How can that be bad? Look, Diana, three people died. Some people think that's bad. They shouldn't. Those people were evil, and now the rest of them want to persecute me. Diana, the jury doesn't want to persecute you. It's their job to determine what the truth is. I'm not talking about the jury. Then who? Who are you talking about? I told you before. The demons. I found a link between the three victims. And it, it's a really... place that sells powdered donuts here, Eddie. Check the medical records. It's really odd they all three died from an allergic reaction to the cookies because it appears as if they're the three healthiest people in all of Salem. It's a weak link, Eddie. I need more than that. No, 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 no. You don't get it. Look at this guy, Robert. 39 years old, right? And when they cut him open, what do they find? He's got the organs of a teenager. And, and a dead councilwoman, wrinkles on her face. Yet her organs haven't aged, man. How do you explain that? Either your paranoia is contagious, Eddie, or that guy over there has got me in his sights. Paranoia is not a contagious condition. It's a way of life. Keep digging, Eddie. I'll talk to you later. The game was truth or dare. You chose truth and proceeded to tell your friends that your boyfriend had become abusive. Yes. And what advice did Diana offer? She told me that my problems with Ross would be over soon. What did she mean by that? I didn't know until later that day when I met Ross at the football field to break up with him. Hey. Whoa, what's your problem? I can't see you anymore, Ross. <laughs> Wrong. You don't break up with me, all right? I break up with you. That ain't happening, okay? Because you... No, Because I'm don't. real hot for you, girl. No. But you get me so steamed up, baby. You get me so steamed up. Stop it! Ross, please! I can't help it. I'm so hot for you, babe. So hot. <laughs> What happened to Ross? He was treated for second and third degree burns. 
Did Diana say how she felt about the terrible tragedy that befell Ross? Diana said that he was just hot and bothered, and he got what he deserved. I'm done with this witness. You're totally wrong. What you're doing to Diana, it's wrong. She helped me. All she did was follow some potion from some stupid book at the Historical Society. That will be enough. I believe in you. I'm your friend, oh, Diana. Your no honor. matter what this your jerk honor. says. Your honor. Order. Order. <laughs> Can you tell me what a Sabbath is? It's a celebration of the full moon. So if I went out and reveled in the full moon, I would be having a Sabbath. If you were a witch. <laughs> so only witches attend the Sabbath. Well, did Diana ever invite you on the Sabbath? I guess. Describe to the court how Diana led you to this witch's celebration. <laughs> come, witches, come. Gather with me in a circle. Yes, High Priestess. Let the Sabbath begin. Let the Sabbath begin. Let the Sabbath begin. Let the Sabbath begin. The ritual of drawing down the moon puts the priestess in a deep trance. I will experience visions and channel words of wisdom to you. Let the Sabbath begin. Let the Sabbath begin. This cup contains water, the element that's ruled by the moon. This will be your sacrament. Sisters, let us direct our psychic energies to our High Priestess Diana, that she may become the embodiment of the Great Goddess. Goddess of the Moon, allow us to draw your magical powers to Earth. Draw the Moon into me. Draw the Moon into me. Draw the Moon into Diana. 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 These 
Demons, did you see them as well? No. Only Diana in her vision. She said that Salem is infested with them. They're all over and they look just like us. Now, did she pinpoint who these demons were? Well, in her vision, she said that she saw Robert Sterling. I see. What did she say she had to do after she identified Mr. Sterling as a demon? Objection. Your Honor, the prosecution is leading the witness. Sustained. Let me rephrase. What did Diana say after seeing Mr. Sterling? She said that we had to get rid of him and the others like him. Did she say why? Because they're here to destroy us. I need to know what you saw. What did the vision look like? Did it have a human face? Shifting around as if there was something lurking inside. A kind of flashing ripple beneath the skin. That's exactly what it looked like. How did you know? Because I've seen them too. You. What do you mean? You're the one, aren't you? The twice blessed man. What do you know about that? It's in the book of shadows. The twice blessed man will be our only hope for survival. Someone who believes me. The aliens are here in Salem. Aliens? Don't you mean demons? Trust me. They're one and the same. <laughs> I don't care. Calm down. So Diana saw aliens in her vision? Yeah, but she mistook them from demons. Oh, I screwed up, Eddie. The Nostradamus Quatrain had me thinking that Diana was an alien. Dark craft shall slay the dragons conjured by humble raven. So the dragons in the Quatrain, they were aliens? Exactly. But if they were aliens, wouldn't they have uh, dissolved when they croaked? There'd be no dead bodies. We know they grow clones, right? And what if the aliens substituted the victims' bodies for duplicates and, and made up the cause of death by falsifying the coroner reports? That would explain why all the victims had healthy organs. Maybe they wanted to put Diana on trial. But why? Well, just think how dangerous she'd be to the aliens. Someone who could root them out and kill them. Why not just kill her? Oh, they must want this trial. Hoping the investigation will determine just how Diana was able to hunt the aliens down. The trial is perfect cover. The evidence, the witnesses, all gathered without raising any suspicion. Diana used an ancient book, the Book of Shadows, to create the potion. Now, the book is supposed to be kept in the historical society. I went there, it was gone. What do you think happened to it? Well, I think the prosecution has it and they're suppressing it. There was no mention of it all in discovery. That could be grounds for dismissal. Exactly. I gotta get my hands on the Book of Shadows, Eddie. It's a weapon that kills aliens. Don't look now, but our peeping Tom's back. Stay cool, Eddie. Be careful. I'll talk to you later. What can I do for you? Cade Linden, Oregon State Attorney General's office. We've received numerous complaints about evidence from procedures. What complaints? Mishandling of evidence, 
Misfiling of evidence? Missing evidence? Should I go on? You got the wrong guy, pal. I bag and tag every single piece of evidence that comes through here. My system's foolproof. Every last item in here has got its own mug shot. So if somebody's missing evidence, it was missing before it got here. That's why they called an investigation, huh? It's your word against theirs. This room is better organized than the Smithsonian. See for yourself. Maybe just a quick peek. Yeah, knock yourself out, pal. Did you remove any pages from the Book of Shadows? No. Did you notice any pages missing? No. I went to the Salem Historical Society every afternoon to read the book. I've been through it a thousand times. All the pages were there. What's going on, Kate? I think we might have found a way to win this trial. May counsel approach the bench, Your Honor? Yes. Both sets of counsel, please approach. Diana, I think those missing pages are the key to meeting your demons. They can help us distinguish who's really human and who's not. I don't know where those pages are. You keep telling us you're a witch. Is that true? Yes. Then you can help me. Tonight's a full moon, right? Your Honor, several witnesses have mentioned a book of shadows. But the defense has not been made privy to it. We believe it's been suppressed by the prosecution. Is the prosecution in possession of this book of shadows? It's not something we've chosen to introduce as evidence, Your Honor. That's not what I asked. Do you have the book? Yes, Your Honor. See that it's in this court first thing tomorrow, or I'll hold you in contempt. Absolutely, Your Honor. That was a stroke of genius, Kate. I think she had called a surprise witness to the stand first thing in the morning. I'll make sure that Phipps doesn't pull any funny stuff. That's a good idea. Did you hide the chapter on the potions? Yes. We have a team coming in tomorrow to study the ingredients in that potion. Now, how would the defense know we suppressed the book? Unless the defense saw the book. I asked you to follow that investigator. Did he go into the evidence room? He may have. I lost him briefly. Kate Linden has become a nuisance. Eliminate him.
get everything? Yeah, but it was murder. I hope I can do this. You have to try, Diana. Full moon's on the rise. It's the witching hour. You fill this with water? Let the Sabbath begin. Hold the knife to your chest and direct your energy toward me. Goddess of the moon, allow us to draw your power to earth. Draw the moon into me. Draw the moon into me. Goddess of the moon, allow us to draw your powers to earth. Salem Historical Society. You okay? Yeah. You all right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna find those missing pages. Thank you, Kate. Thank you. Your Honor, before proceeding, we would like to know if the prosecution has brought the Book of Shadows to court as you directed. We have, Your Honor. These aren't the original pages. Your Honor, the defense would like to call to the stand Mel Ludwig. Objection, Your Honor. This man is not on the defense witness list. The Book of Shadows is new evidence. I must be allowed to explore it. Objection overruled. Proceed. Mr. Ludwig. How would you characterize the way you handle evidence? Meticulously. Mm -hmm. I inventory every item that passes through my window. And I keep detailed notes. Is this the same piece of evidence given to you by the prosecution three months ago? Ah, no. Pages 158 through 160 of the original book were missing. This isn't the same book. Your Honor, the prosecution has tampered with the evidence. This case should be dismissed. Ludwig handles hundreds of pieces of evidence a day. His handwritten scrolls can't possibly be relied upon in a matter of this magnitude. You don't have to rely on my scrolls. I always take Polaroids. Your Honor, this is a severe breach of ethics. I demand that all charges be dropped and my client set free. This is ridiculous. I object, Your Honor. Overruled, counsel. You've made a mockery of my court. Your blatant disregard of justice will not play in this court or in any other court. I will see to that. This case is dismissed. <laughs> you are free. They cannot try you again. Thank you. You're welcome. Excuse me, I, I want to go outside and find my friends. Okay. pages belong to me. I didn't know you lizards could read.
Blessed man. The missing pages dissolved right along with Phipps. There was nothing I could do. Sorry. How about you? You gonna disband the coven for a while? No way. We need it now more than ever. Don't you think? Maybe so. Take care. In Salem, Massachusetts, the witch trials finally stopped when someone asked if perhaps the accusations were not themselves the agency of the devil. In Salem, Oregon, the force behind the biggest witch trial in 300 years was aliens. Diana should be safe now. With the potion destroyed, she's no longer a threat to them. But to get rid of these new devils, we may have to draw upon unseen forces within us. Call it religion, call it prayer, or call it witchcraft. Diana was brave enough to plumb the depths of her spiritual powers. Maybe that's what we all need to do.